Is this beautiful or what? Of course it's beautiful. It's a freaking Ferrari, for God's sake. Specifically, it's a 1965 330 GT 2 plus 2. Right now, you could buy it for $350,000, $400,000. A perfect example like this, maybe half a mil. But just five, 10 years ago, you could buy this for 100 grand. That's chump change by Ferrari standards. Oh man, things were way different in 1965. Look how skinny this wheel is. Where would the airbag go? And look at these seats. These were sports seats back in the day. It's just freaking gorgeous. Oh, the gearbox is nice. These are fairly crude disc brakes, but you really notice the difference yeah. in these and drums. Once you get going, it's not too much. It's at low speeds where you, not only do you need more effort, you need like two or three turns to make yeah. the turn, yeah. <laughs> there ain't much better than the sound of a Ferrari V12. This is a four liter version of Colombo's classic V12. 300 horsepower. Unlike some of the higher horsepower versions, this only has three dual throat Webers. Ferrari came out with the certified program, which is, uh, it's the identity of the car. I mean, everything must match. When you redo one of these cars, there's several things that are very, very important. The chassis number, the engine number, the gearbox number, the differential number, and so many other things match to make sure the car is original. At that point, the car gets certified and th that's how the value of these cars becomes so much. Just because it's not a life two-seater like a 250 GTO doesn't mean it's not absolutely wonderful to drive. In fact, this is one of the highlights of my driving experience. I'm David Booth for driving.ca.